The presidential campaign for Florida Governor Ron DeSantis made a sudden announcement Tuesday that it will replace campaign manager Janera Peck with James Uthmere, the governor's longtime chief of staff, in a shakeup that's sure to spread concern over the campaign's direction and strategy weeks after its much touted reset. Uthmere, despite earning the governor's trust during his first term, has no experience leading a political campaign, much less a national one. He will be advised by Peck during the transition, the campaign said in a press release announcing the change. In a statement to The Messenger, Uthmere shied away from using the term reset to describe the DeSantis campaign's latest change, preferring to call it a change to reload. People have written Governor DeSantis's obituary many times, Uthmere said. From his race against establishment primary candidate Adam Putnam, to his victory over legacy media-favored candidate Andrew Gillum, in 2018, to his 20-point win over Charlie Crist, in 2022, Governor DeSantis has proven that he knows how to win. He's breaking records on fundraising and has a supporting super PAC with $100 million in the bank and an incredible ground game. Get ready. Also advising the new campaign manager will be David Polyansky, who is leaving the pro DeSantis super PAC never back down to come in as deputy campaign manager. Polyansky hasn't been shy of telling colleagues that he boasts an always winning record while leading presidential campaigns through the first in the nation Iowa caucuses. Putting on a good face, former manager Peck said the shakeup only benefits DeSantis, who despite stumbling out of the gate remains the closest challenger to former President Donald Trump in the polls. Governor DeSantis is running one of the most aggressive early state campaigns in modern history, Peck said. Our organization welcomes the best of the best and James is one of my closest colleagues and friends, we are better for his joining and providing day-to-day -day leadership. This team is built to last and built to win. A senior aide to the governor downplayed the lack of political experience by his new campaign manager, saying Uthmere has what it takes to go up against the formidable Trump operation. James is loyal, honest, and a true believer in the conservative principles that Governor DeSantis fights for, a senior campaign staffer said. Over the years, James has earned the governor's trust and confidence, and the team enjoys working with him. He is exactly the right person to manage this campaign so we can help Governor DeSantis win the White House and save our country. The DeSantis operation will be busy preparing their candidate for the Republican National Committee's first debate, set to be held in Milwaukee later this month. President Trump has privately toyed with the idea of skipping the debate in favor of holding his own event, bragging that he's up by too many points and attending the debate only to be roasted by DeSantis and other challengers would be detrimental.